real money team is back. If you're doing holiday shopping this weekend or driving to the airport, you'll be in that amazing race for a parking spot. The average American family spends almost $1,300 a year on parking, more to park our cars than insurance and maintenance. ABC's Paula Ferris now shows you how to keep the money in your pocket. John and Jennifer Law are driving in circles. Nothing here, no standing anytime. Spinning their wheels on the high cost of parking. They're dropping an eye popping $785 every month for work, appointments, and events. Astronomical when you actually break down all the numbers. You're really making me think about this a lot more. But our parking expert, Jeremy Smith, says parking shouldn't put the law's budget in overdrive. Tip number one never pay full price with spothero.com. That's where we find a monthly spot for 30% less than what John is currently paying. Located just a few blocks away from where you're going. And if you're flying to grandma's house for the holidays, check out the app Airport Parking to discover discounted lots that have free transport to the airport. Tip number two, did you know rates can fluctuate wildly from block to block? In Chicago, downtown parking was an eye-popping $42, but just five blocks south, only 13. Tip number three, when attending that big game or holiday concert, prepay on sites like parkwiz.com where they'll guarantee you a spot. And finally, find metered parking without driving round and round. How much time are you wasting? Uh, 20 minutes every time I come in. Using an app called Parker, you can find real-time parking spots in 40 cities. It says that there is plenty of parking in this area. Up oh, two spots just like they predicted. In all, we estimate the laws can park over $2,800 back into their pocketbook this year. And that's real money. Paula Ferris, ABC News, New York.